Hi, it's Tyler here. There are parameters in SEO Quake for all occasions, but sometimes you need more. Sometimes you need something special, something you won't find in any SEO software or toolbar. In this video, I'll show you how to create and add your own SEO parameters for SEO Quake in Firefox. There are two kinds of parameters in SEO Quake values and links. Values show you some value calculated for a specific page or domain. For example, page rank or Alexa rank. Where do these values come from? SEO Quake sends a request for the corresponding service, collects all the necessary data and shows it to you. If you click on such a value, you will be directed to the page SEO Quake gets this data from. Here is, for example, web archive age. Okay now, there is another basic parameter. Links. This is just a fast link to the data you need. For example, who is parameter. It leads us straight to the report on this domain. Let's go back to SEO Quake. We are going to try editing an existing parameter. We go to Preferences, Parameters, Choose who is parameter as an example and click edit. Here is the very parameter. Below is the description of variables and fields. For example, title is the way the parameter is shown on the screen. Let's replace who is with details and save. Reload the page. Here we go. Now this link is called details. It's all that simple as you may see. If you want to create your own parameter, click on new below the list of parameters. Let's pretend we want to create a parameter that would lead us to report on the domain of some service. For example, semrush.com. We need to enter the service address. Get a report on the domain and look for its URL. Now we can add it to SEO Quake. Fill in the required fields in this window. Name is the parameter's name. Let's name it Test. Title is the title as shown in SEO Quake and on pages right next to the parameter. Let's name it also Test. URL R is the address of the required page. In our case, it's semrush.com. Domain is the variable that stands for the domain name of the site we are currently browsing. And this is a regular expression used for searching information on page for link parameters. We don't need to fill it in this time. The next step is saving this parameter by clicking OK. Now we need to reload the page. Here it is. By clicking on it, we will be directed to report on the domain. Let's try that. That works. Now let's proceed with a little more complicated things. Value parameters. Let's open Alexa rank parameter edit window as an example. What we see here is name Alexa rank. This is the parameter's name. Title rank is the way it is represented in SEO Quake. URL R is the URL we need to use when requesting Alexa in order to get data for a domain. URL S is the URL you will be directed to after you click on this parameter in SEO Quake. To compose a correct regular expression is one of the most important things. By means of that, SEO Quake extracts the parameter you need from the page code of any page and any service and shows it to you. In fact, it would take me too much time to explain how to compose a correct regular expression, so I won't do it right now. You may open any parameter edit window and see what they are like. 
You may also read a small article by SEO Quake team on creating parameters. You may find it on the following link. Besides, if you create a new useful parameter, send it to us and we will add it to our collection of parameters here. Thank you for your time. It was Tyler. Watch other video tutorials by SEO Quake Team and subscribe to our channel. Goodbye.